it's your girl. And you guessed it. I went and I visited the slutty vegan that they just opened up in the heart of Brooklyn. If you're from Brooklyn, you definitely know the location. So for starters, um, the line was ridiculously long. It went from one corner to the other corner. I, if I didn't really want to see what all the hype was about, I went and uh, stood in the line. It was a 45 minute wait. Once you get inside, you know, it's really small. If you're aware of what the spot used to be, then you already would expect that. The decor is really, really cute. Um, the serving station, it looks similar to the food truck that the young lady had when she first started. Um, you're going to see a lot of spices. Um, she's selling her merch. The atmosphere seems cool. They're playing hip hop, of course. And the staff is really, really hype. That's one thing I can say for them. They're really, really hype. They make you feel good. They're really inviting. Hopefully they keep, you know, hopefully they keep it up. And so, yeah, I mean, you can check out what they have inside right here. They got the slutty vegan t-shirts. And like I said, they got the spices on deck. Now on to the menu. They only had three burgers available, which I was upset about. Because I already wanted something else, but they had the Fussy Hussy, the One Night Stand, and the Sloppy Toppy. I ended up getting the Fussy Hussy, which comes with bacon, and I added pickles, and I added jalapenos to it, and I got an order of fries. As you can see, that's what the price was. Yeah! yeah! We got a queen from Brooklyn in the building! Yeah! Yeah! Taste-wise, I give it a 7.5. The burger had a meat-like texture to it. I would definitely eat here again. The fries were good as well, but I wouldn't wait 45 minutes to an hour to order.